Welcome everyone on a perfect night for football with the floodlights beaming down. Derek Ray here on the commentary box, joined as always by former England defender Lee Dixon. And coming up for you, action from the Zweite Bundesliga. It's Jan Regensburg and they face Erzgebirge Aue. Thank you, Derek. I was just flicking through my notes at this one. Everything pointing to a really lively matchup. This is fingers crossed, eh? The lineup then for the hosts. A standard 4-4-2, a formation you know well from your playing days, Lee. Yeah, I like this formation, Derek. It's very, very important that when they haven't got the ball, they all stick together. Very solid look about it. When they don't have the ball, very important that they stay close together in midfield. The back four will link across the width of the pitch, but they've got to help the forwards. The two up front need width. This is the lineup for the visitors today. Would you call it 4 5 1, Lee? Yeah, I really like this formation, Derek. 4 2 3 1, really. The two central midfield players supplying support to a three ahead of them, and then a lone striker with a number 10 just behind him. And so the match is underway. Benedict Gimba. Christoph Moritz. Sebastian Stolze. And they'll be happy to have regained possession. Luis Samson. Samson. Zuren Gonter. And unable to keep possession. Van Driech. Pascal Testrut. Well read to put an end to that attack. Max Bezushkov. He's enjoying space. It might be on for them. Passing it around, looking for the goal that would put them ahead. And using his strength, can he give them the lead? Oh, and he puts away the second chance. Goalkeeper error. Here we can take a look at it again. I'm sure the coaching staff will too. Just not good enough, you have to say that. He spilled it right into the danger zone and at this level, you're always going to be punished. The opening goal of the game then. Van Driech. Samson. Samson. And he keeps going, keeping the ball moving. And the right place to cut out the pass. And good pressure high up the pitch. Can he put it away? 
Well, not really a shooting moment he's going to be especially proud of, Lee. Well, he did have other options, but he thought, you know what, I'm just going to have a go. Kruger, Dmitry Nazarov, well, still searching for the equaliser but not passing it anxiously, that's well blocked, able to deal with the threat. The hosts really haven't had too much of the ball, but they won't mind, they're winning this game, and why? Because their counter-attack is absolutely fantastic. It's opening up for them. It should be! And with that, they've thwarted the opportunity. Corner kick played in. Gonter, dangerous looking attack Samson Busman, real danger but it can't get all the way through well his first touch let him down but still he has the ball possession changing hands now let's see what they can do here Hochscheidt Pascal Testrut looks promising this. This could square the game. And that's exactly what has transpired. Now, that could be a massive turning point, and momentum is with them. Well, as we see from the replay, it's a classic pullback cross that sets up the chance. And when he gets through to the keeper, he just smashes it past him and gives him no chance to think. A lovely finish. Even Steven won a piece on this match. Not a huge chunk of added time. One minute. Luis Samson. Hochscheidt. And options in the centre. Van Driech. And there it is, the half-time whistle. I think most fans would be pretty happy with this man's display so far. Well, there's never a bad time to score a goal, but just before half-time can be crucial. And he's got his team back in this game. What can he produce in the second half? And so the match is underway. Plenty to consider based on what we've seen so far as the second half begins. Dmitry Nazarov. Van Driech. Oh, they've lost it. Max Bezushkov. No chance for him to get in behind, maybe. Getting forward. Still pushing for the goal that would put them ahead, but not forcing it. Max Bezushkov. A really sumptuous ball. It's still alive. 
Well, nothing comes of it. Van Driech. And they'll get ready for the throw-in. And with play stopped, they will make the change now. Zala. And we're inside the final 30 minutes. Stolze. It might be on for them. And no nonsense defensive clearance. Pascal Testrut. And giving it away. Pascal Testrut. Samson. Every pass hitting its target. He could pick out a teammate. Well, no stopping him. But after that fantastic effort, it's gone out for a throw-in. Substitution time it is here. Luis Samson. Oh, a tremendous block. Well, not really a shooting moment he's going to be especially proud of, Lee. Well, he did have other options, but he thought, you know what, I'm just going to have a go. Max Vesushkov. That's a good looking ball. Interception to snuff out the danger. So a throw in here. Substitution time it is. Chance to cross. Christoph Moritz. It is a decent looking attack here. And a throw in forthcoming. Only five minutes left for play, and tension galore with the teams locked together. Oh, lovely incisive pass. Well, it all counts for naught. Well, they still have designs on the win. And space for the cross. It's opening up for them. And able to get a body in the way. That is that after 90 minutes. They are level and extra time is coming up.